Good morning, folks, on this 6th of June. Let's see what we uh, might glean from a, a wee passage of scripture and some comments from Spurgeon upon it. We're looking to the book of Job, chapter 40 and verse 4, where he, he declares, Behold, I am vile. Spurgeon has this comment to make, make about it. One cheering word, poor lost sinner for thee. You think you must not come to God because you are vile. Now, there is not a saint living on earth but has been made to feel that he is vile, if Job and Isaiah and Paul were all obliged to say, I am vile, O oh, poor sinner, wilt thou be ashamed to join in the same confession? If divine grace does not eradicate all sin from the believer, how dost thou hope to do it but thyself? And if God loves his people while they are yet vile, dost thou think thy vileness will prevent his loving thee? Believe on Jesus, thou outcast of the world's society. Jesus calls thee, and such as thou art. Not the righteous, not the righteous, sinners Jesus came to call. Even now say, thou hast died for sinners. I am a sinner. Lord Jesus, sprinkle thy blood on me. Thou wilt confess thy sin, thou shalt find pardon. If now with all thy heart thou wilt say, I am vile, wash me. Thou shalt be washed now, but the Holy Spirit shall enable thee from the hearts to cry, Just as I am without one plea, but that thy blood was shed for me, and that thou biddest me come to thee, O Lamb of God, I come. Thou shalt rise from reading this morning's portion with all thy sins pardoned. And now, though thou didst wake this morning with every sin that man hath ever committed on thy head, thou shalt rest to-night accepted in the Beloved. Though once degraded with the rags of sin, thou shalt be adorned with a robe of righteousness, and appear white as the angels are. But now, mark it, now is the accepted time. If thou believest on him who justifies the ungodly, thou art saved. O oh, may the Holy Spirit give thee saving faith in him who receives the vilest. That's some food for thought this day and I pray we might uh, take it to heart and it might do us good. Until the next time, God bless. Do take care. Bye for now.